Hello and welcome to Skyria.com. My name is Dr. Heather Ali. With Skyria.com, you can enjoy thousands of lectures at home or anywhere. Today, we are, talk we are going to talk about hypertensive emergency. Let's go to the outline. First, we will define hypertension. What is hypertension? What are the two classifications of hypertension, which includes primary or essential hypertension and secondary hypertension? What do you mean by the term asymptomatic hypertension? And what might be the cause of hypertension, which includes cerebral and renal vascular injuries or vascular diseases? Next, we talk about hypertension emergency. We classify hypertensive crisis or hypertensive emergency into two parts. That's hypertensive emergency and hypertensive urgency and how to differentiate in between them. What do you mean by reducing pressure of certain limit in a, in a patient with acute hypertensive emergency? What do you mean by end organ damage? That will be explained under this section. Next will be pathophysiology of hypertensive emergency. What are the events that cause hypertensive emergency? What do you mean by loss of autoregulatory functions? And how is it affected, and especially dealing with a re a sudden uh, reducing the blood pressure? Next, we'll talk about some red flags, some dangerous red flags that need to be understand that need to be memorized by an emergency physician to look for in a patient with acute hypertensive emergency. That includes several of them, which includes CNS system, chest and cardio cardiopulmonary system, renal system, and vascular system. Next, we'll talk about the history of how a patient to be, how is patient presented and what to you, what to you, what to ask for in a patient with acute hypertensive emergency. What are the things to, to look for in a patient with, in the history of a patient with acute hypertensive emergency. Next will be the physical examination. What are the vital signs? What are the fundoscopic examinations to be done? What are the eye findings that can help you differentiate in a chronic or acute uh, hypertensive emergencies? What are the neurological symptoms or sign that could be appreciated on physical examination that can help you and make a diagnosis that it can be due to acute hypertensive emergencies? Then will be differential diagnosis. What are the number of diseases that are linked with acute hypertensive emergencies or with hypertension, which includes some uh, cardiac diseases, vascular diseases, CNS problems, visual disturbances, and especially females with, who are pregnant. Then would be what would be the diagnostic testing that are useful in, in treating the patient with again hypertensive emergencies and what are the things to be looked into for patients with acute hypertensive emergencies mainly and organ damage. Then will be treatment, the treatment drugs that can be given in emergency department. And next will be special patients, which includes pediatric population, pregnant females, and patients with stroke. And at the end, some myths will be discussed. So you can watch a complete lecture on Ascaria.com. Start your free trial today. You can enjoy thousands of lectures on medical sciences, which includes basic medical sciences, clinical medical sciences at Ascaria.com. Thank you.